Let's solve this equation for x. And remember what that means. That means we want to find the value for x that makes that a true statement. To do so, we use properties of equality to allow us to write simpler equations. For example, I have negative 4x is equal to 48. This is negative 4 times x. So on the left side, I'm going to divide by negative 4. And if I do so on the left side, I've got to do so on the right side also. And why did I do that? Because look, the negative 4's divide out. And I have 1x over 1, which is simply x. So I have x by itself is equal to 48 divided by negative 4, and that is negative 12. So once I have x by itself, I see that my solution for x is negative 12. Let's actually check. To check, I'm going to go and rewrite the original equation, but instead of x, I'll write negative 12. Now, is that indeed equal to 40a? That's our question. Negative 4 times negative 12, a negative times a negative is positive, and 4 times 12 is 48. So it does make it a true statement. The solution then is indeed negative 12.